It is the apex. It is the fulcrum of God's grand and glorious lever 4,000 years in the crafting where one man on one tree on one Friday pride a fallen race including every one of us out of Satan's unrelenting grasp that cross rough and rugged that cross mangled and mean but it is there there at the crossroads of those two rough hewn wooden beams where we can look in horrified wonder at the raw veracity of the love of God outpoured on fallen humanity and today we sing and we shout and we're free and heaven is our eternal home because the blood paid it all somebody give him glory Hallelujah for all he's done. No, I mean for everything he's done for you. For every step up Calvary's rugged craggy hill. For every red rivulet drop of crimson blood running down his naked side dripping off his bloody toes into pools upon the earth. For every devil defeated, every demon crushed, every principality dethroned. Because it is finished. It's not going to be finished. The last chapter has been written. Every devil is defeated. Jesus is not only exalted, he is Lord. Give him praise. Give him glory. The curse is broken. And we are free. That ringing in your ears stops now. That catch in your shoulder disappears now. That lump in your breast goes now. The victory that God promised you 22 years ago is yours now. every person who has ever had a surgical procedure that didn't turn out right and something's not right after that surgery I release you now into total health as though you never had to have the operation to begin with in Jesus
there should have already been 20 leaders running, shouting, praising. Miss Lisa. I'll stop in a minute, but just give me a minute. Just give me a minute. Postpartum depression. I rebuke you in Jesus' name. I release joy. Post traumatic stress disorder in the name of Jesus. You have ears. You listen to me. Go! Go! Shove your neighbor till they know they've been shut. Tell them I love a good ghost story. I said, tell them I love a good ghost story. Now shout, Holy Ghost! Holy Ghost! Holy Ghost! Shake us up! Now give God glory! This is the day we celebrate when he came into Jerusalem to pay the price. I think we ought to throw some palms of victory, some crowns of glory, palms of victory, crowns of glory. They threw palm leaves in front of it. We don't have to cut something off a dead tree. We got palms of victory. We got crowns of glory. Throw them at him now. Here I go. Throw both hands up in the air and shout. It's Palm Sunday in 2014. Take your left hand. Look at it. Take your right hand. Count the knuckles. Start with your thumb. One, out loud. One. Next finger. I can't hear you. Next finger. Seven. I can't hear you. Stop. How many knuckles you got left? How many knuckles you got left? One in what year? 2014. Now look at your palm. This is the year God opens a door no man can close. Wave palms of victory. God's taking that arthritis out of your hands. He's straightening out those crooked fingers. Your wrists are being loosed. Your elbows are being loosed. Your shoulders are being loosed. <laughs> Somebody that had a joint fused, it is now loose. Indiana last week I'm conducting a revival meeting I'm not supposed to preach on Thursday but I preached anyway I wish somebody clap get up here remnant and help me bless him everybody in Elkhart Indiana shout everybody in Car
Columbus, Ohio, shout! Everybody all across America together, shout! <laughs> Tell somebody I love a good ghost story. I love a good ghost story. I love a good ghost story. Want me to tell you a ghost story? You want me to tell you a ghost story? This is Miss Lisa Brunson. Everybody know Miss Lisa? She's a worship director at all our ministers. That's her husband, Elder Gamain, over there. They're getting ready to have their second child. Everybody say two. Somebody say two. Somebody say two. Wednesday night in here, it was three. When I got to Elkhart, Indiana, it was 40. Somebody shout two. 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 God just healed two people in their lower back. Why aren't you shouting? sons and two daughters who have been out of fellowship with their parents will in the next 48 hours contact their parents and reunite with their parents. I don't care whether you believe my ghost stories or not. This your second baby. This is your second baby. Yes, sir. This is your second baby. Yes, sir. Your sister was a worship leader here before you. Yes. She was going to have her second baby. Yes. She was going to have her second. Yes, sir. I said she was going to have her second baby. Yes, sir. You're about to have your second baby. Yes, sir. I said you're about to have your second baby. Yes, sir. I don't care what the doctor said. You're about to have your second baby. Yes, sir. I don't care what the doctor said. You're about to have... a ghost story. I said, shout, go ahead, pastor, tell us a ghost story. My second child is healed. Every neurological disorder healed. Every brain situation Every second child, raise your hand. Every second child, raise your hand. Raise your other hand. Here comes a double portion anointing in the now. trying to kill you, take you out. I'm here to tell you, God today is releasing the angel, angels, 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 angels. This is the year, if you don't know what it means, shout anyway. This is the year of a double Adar. This year on the 
Jewish calendar, God inserts an extra month. You're in it right now where the end gets extended so that God can crush your enemies and step you into a new beginning. giving signs in the heavens, in the stars, in the sun, in the moon, in the calendar, in the days, in the dates, in the seasons, in the year. He may come before we get out of this building. Welcome him on Palm Sunday. Shop, tell me a good ghost story. Every sexually transmitted disease from your past is canceled, says the Lord. Don't say there's no cure. Shout, Jesus is the cure. Everybody. never have again is yours now God's given you your virginity back told me I spoke about cataracts in one eye. I don't remember which one. He just said this is a day of double. Both eyes get healed today. Both kidneys get healed today. I'm going to do it unless it hurts my ears when you shout. Shout, tell us a good ghost story, Pastor. Some of you didn't even open your mouth. Come on. You just, look, I'm not going to rebuke you anymore. You just stand there and get nothing if you want to. But this is not a show. This is a demonstration of the Holy Ghost. Shout. Tell us a ghost story. Your sister, your sister was going to have her second child. She was going to have her second child. She was going to have her second child. You're pregnant with what child? My second. You're pregnant with what child? Our second. She was going to have her second child. Yes. I'm a second child. Mm -hmm. I'm a second child. I'm a second child, and when I was 17 years old, the devil tried to take me out. When I was eight years old, the devil tried to take me out, but here I am. I'm in Elkhart, Indiana, Thursday night, Thursday.
Thursday night. I said God is moving in the number 40. Lady started screaming. I said, what's the matter with you? She said, last Thursday, God set me free from 40 years of pill addiction. And I'd had pills every day for 40 years. I haven't had one for seven days. And I'm... You were there. Why is he the only one that follows me? I ask you to not stop clapping. Why do you want us to do that? Because it's skin on skin notifying every devil. Jesus is making a triumphal entry. Palm Sunday and he has no authority here come here lady pink come here hurry somebody shouting here comes a ghost story stand right there where are you from? Where Florida. are you from? Florida. Florida. When did you first start watching me? 91. 1991. What was I preaching? Repairs of the breach. But you're here today on Palm Sunday. I'm not even gonna look at you. You got a seed in your hand, right? I said, you have a seed you brought in your hand, right? Yes. Have I seen it? No. Do I know what it is? No. Have you been having stress problems because of your work? Yes. Yes. Because your work, yes. your business has exploded? Yes. Hey. Yes. And you don't know what to do about it? Because you need lots of help. God is going to double the efficiency of your top five employees. And there are five more coming into your business. All you got to do is double that seat. So much sound. I want a ghost story. I want a ghost story. I want a ghost story. You're pregnant with your second baby. Yes, sir. Your second baby. Yes, sir. Your sister was pregnant with her second baby. Yes. The doctor said to your sister, all the organs of your second child have developed outside your baby's body. We need to abort this baby. Yes. True or false? True. You have that same doctor. True yes. or false? True. That doctor had to tell your sister after she and her husband sowed a thousand dollar seed, sang for three days on this platform, went back to the doctor. The doctor had to say, you go tell those crazy people at that wonderful church that you now have a perfectly formed, completely healthy baby. Did that child 12 years later sing on this platform at Battle Christian College Chapel Thursday? That's true, Pastor. What's your husband's name? Brian. What's your husband's name? Brian? Everybody shout, Brian. Brian. Today yeah. receives Receive. a double portion double. anointing yeah. of wisdom. Yeah. If you'd run, he'd give it to you too. If you'd shout, he'd give it to you too. If you'd wave palms of victory, 
That's 12 years ago. 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 You with me at a revival in Elkhart, Indiana. You get messed up in your sinuses, your vocal cords, you got strep throat. I said, go to the doctor. The doctor checked that, but he found no heartbeat in your baby, and there'd been no movement in your baby. I knew nothing about that. Last Sunday morning, while you were shouting in here, I prophesied to her, knowing nothing, telling her what was going to happen with that baby. You came back three days later, went to your OBGYN, who is the same doctor that examined your sister, and your doctor said, and my baby's perfectly normal, healthy. I'm in Elkhart, Indiana, Thursday night. I said, God's moving in 40s. Yes. I prophesied to a young man. You've been worshiping Satan. Yes. Satan came and smashed into your bedroom wall and scared you nearly to death. Yes, sir. Well, 40 is the cycle of a fly, and the devil is defeated, and Beelzebub is defeated. That boy got loose from methamphetamine, crack cocaine, marijuana, alcohol, and is probably right now running around the tabernacle in Elkhart, Indiana. Just show somebody and say, tell me a good ghost story. 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 Next time somebody asks you, what's going on at World Harvest Church on Easter Sunday morning? Ghost stories. They're telling ghost stories. Postpartum depression, post-traumatic stress disorder are gone. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? Every soldier that ever served in a combat position, run to this altar. Shout! Shout for America's finest and bravest. And today, 
everything that God put on them comes off them, out of their mind. No more dreams, no more dreams, no more nightmares, no more nightmares, no more nightmares, no more nightmares, no more nightmares. Come here. systems you're never gonna have to take another roll aid come pastor, what's his name pastor this is adrian what's up adrian adrian served in operation iraqi freedom he hasn't been to church for five months. He hasn't been to church for five months. He told his wife. Today. He told his wife last night, I'm going to church tomorrow morning. And he came to church, and this is what you said. Everybody that ever served in a combat position, come on down here. He came down. He's believing God for complete freedom. Did you think? that I would use you and put you in harm's way? Did you think that I would let you see what you saw and experience what you experienced to bring up freedom to others and not set you free, says God? You will go into a dimension of freedom this day that you never dreamed was possible. Everything the devil put on you is coming off and God's about to double your blessing. Shout, tell me a ghost story. So I'm over there. Shout revival! Revival! I don't care whether religious people like it or not. I don't care whether 45 minutes on Sunday morning Christians like it or not. We're in revival! I'm over there on Thursday. I said 40. I was on a stool like this and I spun around. You. And pointed to a lady. I said, come up here. She came up on the platform. I said, how old are you? She said, 46. The Holy Ghost said, I told Elder Germain before she ever came up what was going to happen. Did I? Where's the microphone? Did I? Yes, sir. And I spun around and I pointed at that lady. And I told her she was from the deep south. She was from Mississippi. Yes, sir. But she's in Elkhart, Indiana. Yes, sir. She's 46 years old, not 40. But the Holy Ghost said when you were 16, Something traumatic happened in your life, and you've never been the same since. And tonight, Jesus comes to set you free. Yes, sir. I said, what happened to you when you, she was, when you were six years old? She said, when I was six years old, a man came in my house 
with a gun in each hand and started shooting up a house and shot me in the face when I'm six years old and I've been bound ever since. I said, not now you're not. Okay, run back to your seat, shout. 